Stephen Duffy. From Wikipedia, the free encyclopedia. Jump to navigation, jump to search. This biography of a living person needs additional citations for verification. Please help by adding reliable sources. Contentious material about living persons that is unsourced or poorly sourced must be removed immediately, especially if potentially libelous or harmful. Find sources, Stephen Duffy, News Middle. Newspapers Middle. Books Middle. Scholar Middle. August 2016. Learn how and when to remove this template message. Stephen Duffy. Birth name Stephen Anthony James Duffy. Also known as Tintin, Duffy. Born May 30, 1960, age 60. Alum Rock, Birmingham, England. Occupations Musician, Singer, Songwriter. Instruments Vocals, Guitar, Bass, Drums, Keyboards. Years Active 1978 Present. Labeled Virgin Records. Sire, Warner Brothers Records. Associated Acts The Lilac Time, Duran Duran, The Devils, The Hawks, Dentin, Dr. Calculus, Robbie Williams, Bare Naked Ladies, Me Me Me. Stephen Anthony James Duffy, born May 30, 1960 in Alum Rock, Birmingham, England, is an English musician, singer and songwriter. He was a founding member, vocalist, bassist and then drummer of Duran Duran. He went on to record as a solo performer under several different names, and is the singer and songwriter for the Lilac Time with his older brother Nick. He has also co-written with Robbie Williams 1, and Stephen Page. 2. Contents 1. Duran Duran and other early work 2. Tin Tin 3. Dr. Calculus 4. The Lilac Time 5. Solo 6. The Devils 7. Return to the Lilac Time. 8. Work with Robbie Williams and Stephen Page. 9. Film Documentary. 10. Discography. 10.1 The Hawks. 10.2 Tin Tin. 10.3 Stephen Tin Tin Duffy. 10.3.1 Albums. 10.3.2 Singles. 10.4 Doctor Calculus. 10.5 Albums. 10.6 Singles 10.7 The Lilac Time 10.8 Stephen Duffy 10.8.1 Albums 10.8.2 Singles 10.9 Duffy 10.9.1 Albums 10.9.2 Singles 10.10 Me 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 10.11 The Devils 11 References 12 Further Reading 13 External Links Duran Duran and Other Early Work While attending the School of Foundation Studies and Experimental Workshop at Birmingham Polytechnic, now Birmingham City University, Duffy met John Taylor. Together they formed the group Duran Duran, along with Taylor's childhood friend, Nick Rhodes. While Taylor was the guitarist, later switching to bass, and Rhodes played the synthesizer. Duffy was the band's vocalist, lyricist and bassist. When bass player Simon Colley joined, Duffy moved to drums. 3. He left both the school and the band in 1979, before Duran Duran signed with Emmy in 1980. 4. He went on to form obviously five believers, sometimes known as the Subterranean Hawks or the Hawks, and he made his first four-track recordings. The Hawks' only single, Words of Hope, was released in 1981. 4. Tintin. In 1982, he created the band Tintin, with John Mulligan and Dick Davis, both then of fashion, Andy Stoker Grocott, of Dexie's Midnight Runners, and Bob Lamb, original producer of Birmingham band UB40. Originally called Holy Tintin before being shortened, the band was signed with Wii Records in the UK and released the single Kiss Me in 1982 but was unsuccessful. By 1983, Tintin had signed with Sire Records in the U.S., and Kiss Me hit the dance charts there. Citation Needed, another single, Hold It, was also released in 1983 which peaked at number 55 in the U.K. 4. After a stint of working in the U.S., 
Duffy returned to England and signed a deal as a solo artist with Virgin 10. Now working under the name Stephen Tintin Duffy, which was frequently mocked by Radio 1 DJs as Stephen Duff Duff Tenny citation needed, he recorded a new version of Kiss Me which was released in 1984, this time only in the local West Midlands area, followed by a nationwide release of She Makes Me Quiver which peaked at number 88 in September 1984. At the end of 1984, Duffy recorded a third version of Kiss Me, produced by J.J. Jeslick and Nicholas Froome, which was released in February 1985. It debuted at number 22 and peaked at number 4 in the UK singles chart and stayed in the UK top 10 for five weeks altogether. Duffy followed this with the single Icing on the Cake, which peaked at number 14 in June 1985. Duffy's first full album, The Ups and Downs, produced by Duffy, Froome, Jeslek, Booker T. Jones, and Stephen Street, reached number 35 in the UK. 4. Prior to the release of The Ups and Downs, Stephen Duffy and his brother Nick formed their own design office called Duffy and Duffy. For the album's preview release, they had an exhibition of about 80 paintings, drawings, photographs, and video. 5. A new single, Unkiss That Kiss, was released in September 1985 and peaked at number 77 in the UK. For this single, Duffy had become known as Stephen A.J. Duffy after dropping the Tintin reference from his stage name. The single was the first to be taken from the album Because We Love You, released in early 1986, for which he was credited simply as Stephen Duffy. Additional singles from the album were I Love You, which peaked at number 86, and Something Special which was a collaboration with Sandy I, of Sandy I and the Sunsets, 4, however this single, and the album itself, failed to chart. Dr. Calculus Duffy also recorded a non-stop 40-minute early chill-out, house album in 1986 called Designer Beatnik with Roger Freeman of Pigbag, released under the name Dr. Calculus Mdma. The cover photo shows the spirit of ecstasy Rolls Royce car mascot and the album's two singles were Program 7 and Perfume from Spain. The Lilac Time Main article, The Lilac Time In 1986, Duffy began writing and recording music that would become The Lilac Time's first album, released on Swordfish Records. The album, entitled The Lilac Time, came out in November 1987 and was subsequently reissued in remixed form by Fontana on February 8, 1988. The Lilac Time have gone through various lineup changes with the Duffy Brothers as mainstays. The group originally consisted of Stephen Duffy, his elder brother Nick Duffy, and friend Michael Weston, who recorded the first album together, Michael Geary and Fraser Kent join when the band was ready to go on tour. The Lilac Time put out the album's Paradise Circus in 1989 and And Love For All in 1990 for Fontana before being dropped. The group were then briefly signed to Creation Records, and were subsequently managed by label head, Alan McGee. Their sole release on Creation was Astronauts in 1991. In 1991, the band split up, temporarily, as it turned out and Duffy subsequently pursued a solo career. Solo The 1993 Stephen Duffy album Music in Colors, Parlophone, was recorded with Nigel Kennedy, and featured the singles Natalie and Holt and Hotel. The next album was called Simply Duffy, released in August 1995 on Indolent Records. London Girls and Sugar High went to the top 10 on the UK indie chart. Starfit was also released as a single in the U.S. The album was reissued on CD in 2000 by BMG Fun House. He participated in a temporary supergroup called Me Me Me, consisting of Duffy, Alex James of Blur, Justin Welch of Elastica and Charlie Blower. The one-off single, Hanging Around, was released August 5, 1996, and reached number 19 on the U.K. chart. I Love My Friends was released in 1998 by Cooking Vinyl Records, who also released the singles 17 and You Are. 
Virgin released a compilation album entitled They Called Him Tintin in 1999. The Devils In 1999, Duffy found a tape recording of 1978-1979 to Duran Duran music that was in storage. Shortly afterwards, he had a chance meeting with Nick Rhodes. Reminiscences led to a desire to collaborate, and they ended up pre-recording the music on the tape. They did not change any of the lyrics, and used only late 70s era instrumentation with modern recording techniques. The result was the album Dark Circles, released under the name The Devils. Return to the Lilac Time Duffy reformed the Lilac Time with brother Nick and Michael Geary, along with new members Claire Warrell and Melvin Duffy, no relation. They released Looking for a Day in the Night in 1999 on Spine Art Records. 6, and Lilac 6 on Cooking Vinyl in 2001. Compendium, The Fontana Trinity, a collection of tracks from their singles and first three albums was also released in 2001. The album Keep Going was released in 2003 on Folk Modern Records under the name Stephen Duffy and the Lilac Time. In 2007, Duffy released a new album and limited edition, 2000 Copies book called Run Out Groove and held a few rare performances with the full Lilac Time Ensemble, notably headlining the Green Man Festival. Work with Robbie Williams and Stephen Page In 1987, Duffy was contacted by Stephen Page, then of the band Scary Movie Breakfast, and was impressed by his writing and demo tape. Duffy and Page began co-writing songs. Their work together produced popular Bare Naked Ladies songs like Jane, Alcohol and Call and Answer, the final two included on the platinum-selling album Stunt, as well as material on Page's solo album The Vanity Project. Duffy's songwriting ability earned him his first number one in October 2004, as the co-writer of the Robbie Williams single Radio, one of two new tracks recorded for Williams' greatest hits album. Seven. In October 2005, Robbie Williams released Intensive Care, fully co-written and co-produced by Stephen Duffy. 8. The album gained him a great deal of exposure, critical acclaim and went on to sell over 8 million copies becoming Williams' best-selling studio album around the world. Duffy then went on to work as the musical director for Williams' Close Encounters World Tour. Film Documentary the Douglas Aerosmith documentary Memory and Desire, 30 Years in the Wilderness with Stephen Duffy and the Lilac Time was filmed over six years and includes vintage footage of the band. The film Nine, was released at the London Raindance Film Festival in October 2009, accompanied by a Universal Records album of the same name, bringing together songs from Duffy's 30 years of music making. Duffy agreed to a request to sit by sculptor John Edgar in London in 2008. The Terracotta Work 10 was coincidentally documented during the filming of the Douglas Aerosmith documentary Memory and Desire. An image appears on the CD cover for the Memory and Desire 2009 album. Discography The Hawks Words of Hope 7 Inches, 1981, Five Believers Tin Tin. Kiss Me, U.S. Remix, October 1982-11, We. Hold It, July 1983-12, We, UK number 55. Stephen Tintin Duffy. Albums. The Ups and Downs, 1985, 10 Records, UK number 35, Come number 83-13. Because We Love You, 1986, 10 Records. They called him Tintin, 1998, Virgin VIP. Singles. Kiss Me, 1982, We Records 14. She Makes Me Quiver, 1984-15, 10 Records, UK Number 88. Kiss Me, 1985-16, 10 Records, UK Number 4, Owls Number 16, 17, Kim Number 89-18. I Sing on the Cake, 1985-19, 10 Records, UK Number 14, Owls Number 46-17. Uncas That Kiss, 1985-20, 10 Records, UK Number 77.
I Love You, 1986-21, 10 Records, UK number 86. Something Special, 1986-22, 10 Records, Stephen Duffy and Sandy I. I Love You, Wednesday Jones, 1986-23, 10 Records, Double Seven. Kiss Me, 1989, Reissue on Old Gold. Dr. Calculus. Albums. Designer Beanick, 1986, 10 records. Singles. Program 7 Inches, 1985-24, 10. Perfume from Spain, 1986-25, 10. The Lilac Time. Main article, The Lilac Time Section Discography. Stephen Duffy. Albums. Music in Colors, 1993, Parlophone. Singles. Natalie, 1993-26, Parlophone. Duffy. Albums. Duffy, 1995, Indolent, UK number 121-27. I Love My Friends, 1998, Cooking Vinyl, UK number 155-27. Singles. London Girls, 1995-28, Indolent. UK number 180-27. Sugar High, 1995-29, Indolent, UK number 83-27. Starfit, 1996, Summershine. Needle Mythology, 1996-30, Indolent, UK number 131-27. 17, 1997, Indolent. 17, 1998. Cooking Vinyl. UR, 1998, Cooking Vinyl. Me Me Me. Hanging Around, 1996-31, Indolent, UK number 19. The Devils. Dark Circles, 2002, Tape Modern.